Yeah, blazing 106.3 under the microscope hour. It's your girl Tiara Shante. It's your boy Remo. You know, we finna get into this interview, but first, have you heard about Kanye and Kim Kardashian? They supposed to be having a baby? Like, what the? Kim Ye? Uh, that's nasty. Um, Ratchet? Yeah, uh, so what is she gonna be like, just doing pedicures and manicures on her baby? Like, is I don't she? Know. How you gonna get a, a married woman pregnant? I mean, I'm just saying, like, does she even know how to take care of a child? No. Uh, we gonna see how this play out. That's crazy. But, uh, hey, yo, yo, you heard about Jay Z? What about him, bruh? Yo, this man done built a one million dollar nursery what? in a Barclay Center. I mean, I'm just daughter. saying though, can I like be a pet? You know, I just need a little studded collar or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Just a little <laughs> something, something right? You know? A uh, one million dollar nursery? Yo, man, but let's wow. you know, let's go in. Let's talk about, you know, the Dow, man. The Dow finish. You know, the last day up. And everything looking good. The politicians definitely got the fiscal cliff out of the way, so you know, that's positive for the markets in general. So, but let's introduce our next guest though, man. We got Trillionaire. Trillionaire. Trillionaire? You dig? You dig. What's going on, boy? No sad in the world. What's going on, real? I'm, I'm up in here. You up in here? I'm up in here. Oh, okay, man. I'm touch your you sleep. You know, yeah, I think you're a little microphone shy. You know what I'm trying to say? That's not a good trait to have as a rapper. That's what I'm saying. This man came in all hype. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Came in here smelling like the finest kush. You know? Okay. Just blaze? Okay, okay. <laughs> so, so, what's going on, son? Look, man, I'm working on this Mac of Mix tape right now. Um, uh, it was supposed to be named Super Tree, but I changed the name to uh, Mecca. Mecca? Yeah. Oh, yeah, well, why you chose that name? Because, like, Mecca is the, like, it's the, it's the, it's where it all begins, in a sense. So, like, Mecca is, like, the foundation of what I'm about to start doing. Like, I'm about to start doing something a little different, so... In order to be a king, you gotta be the back of where you from. And what what's the reason for this change? Like, why do you feel you have to do something different? Why do I feel like I'm gonna... Yeah, I mean, because, like, you know, what what you've been doing has been working for you. Like, why switch it up? What, what's what been going on to make you switch it up? Right, because I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm trying different things with different audiences. Like, you know, I mean, you make one record that fits one genre most times, so I'm True. just stepping out the box True. and trying different things with different audiences. Right, you know, because everything can't be for the ass shakers, you know, you got to get a little church music, a little something, yeah. you know, a little something like church ladies on swing their hats too, I feel you, bro, I feel you. <laughs> Hey, okay. man, but, but that's tight, man. The Mecca, man. I like that name, but, you know, any type of special production is going to be on the mixtape? A lot, man. I got uh, Mike Will, uh, who may be. Uh-huh. Uh, Bagel Dish on the beach. Mm. Arkansas. Hang on. Oh, wow. And, um, <laughs> oh, man. And um, I got a lot of different people. This okay. A lot of different productions from a lot of different companies. And, um... Uh, just working on a lot of different things. Seems yeah. like you got some heavy hitters on there. So I'm I'm checking I'm checking our Twitter page, you know, and the ladies are, you know, they jumping in, they asking, so I mean, are you seeing anybody right now? You you know, how, how, you got somebody special in your life? <laughs> actually I do. Oh yeah? Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, actually I do. Um she good. She good people, so like, you know, she really good and uh just keep it a hundred with her and all the time. Now, forget that. I keep three thousand. That's what it is. That's what <laughs> yeah, it is. That, that, that's definitely cool, man. Hey, yo, shout like, out to the special lady in Trillion Life. You know what I'm saying? You know, Since she you know, keeping it winding. Keep doing 3,000. Keep, keep doing 3,000. 3, you know, that's how we doing it. Uh, keep doing your thing. Hey, but besides that, though, like, you know, besides rap, you know, what's, what else going on with Trillion? Backpack giveaway for the kids. Working on some community events yeah. for the summer, you know, like giving away, giving away some t-shirts and some backpacks and some back school drives and getting ready to come up for me this year and doing a little modeling and, a little, and believe it or not, I am doing a little school too on the side. Okay. That's what's up. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's definitely up. positive and that's definitely cool. Just keep it rocking. Yeah, yeah. furthering your education is definitely a good look. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Yeah. definitely. And just trying out, just trying different things. I'm stepping out of my element. I'm definitely stepping out of my element. Okay. okay. So would you say you like a hip hop chameleon? You know what I'm saying? Try to switch it up, change it up a little bit. Exactly. 
I mean, I'm just saying, you know, you gotta switch it up. You can you can adapt to any situation that you in. You feel me? Yeah, I mean, I feel like in the time, I mean, I do. But I mean, I'm the king, so like, I'm being changed. Oh, okay, just, okay. This this year is gonna be really different because like. You know, I'm looking at this thing from a chess standpoint of view right now. How I'm about to attack the game, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, how I'm about to attack it, I'm about to put some of these grapples across my leg and get them spiking real fast. Oh, wow. Wow. Like, uh, you know, tapping that chill. ass, tapping that ass. <laughs> <laughs> chill, 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 man. Why are you speaking about all of that, man? What happened? I remember when I came to Columbia, South Carolina. You know, when we, me and you got up, and you was with the group, the gutters, you know, the gutter boys. So, like, what's going on with them? You still rocking with them, or you just now on your solo thing? I always been on my solo thing. Oh, okay. The gutter boys, we have a partnership that started out, that ended up into be a disaster. I ain't got no problem with DJ Gutter Gutter and the gutter boys, but they know they, they know where they at. Now I'm I'm scrolling down on our Facebook page and I see, you know, there's a lot of uh kind of little controversial stuff going on, like, you know, what's going on with like this little black black dude or you know, a, a little holy or something. Have you uh, look, heard look about these? Dude. Yeah, you know, these, <laughs> these little dudes I mean I'm just saying because it seems like they trying to you know, get around and say little things on the slide but not really being man enough to say your name. So, did you want to address that, you know? Let's take a shot, huh? You know, let's put a nigga in his place time. Okay. Some people will do anything for some fame. I feel you, bro. Some people do some anything, you. but for, for the record, yeah. like I said, I'm going to leave this man with he at, but just know, if you listening to this interview, Bro, don't even do it, man. Don't, don't, just don't do it, cause like don't do I'm it. in a whole nother league right now. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, it, 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 this, this music, this music game gets a lot of people twisted with my real life. You know what I'm saying? This is not my real life. My real life right. is what I rap about. Straight up. But this is my occupation. This is where I make money from. So like. I do got a life outside of what I do, but I'm just making everybody know like this guy, this man can't beat me in a freestyle battle competition, <laughs> none of that. Then even if he tried, shots fired. Okay. So okay. like, I'm gonna just see, you know, who gonna come out hard. My objective is to see who come out hard. Me and my team, we gonna be straight. Yeah, we doing pretty good. We gonna take over this so, year. Oh, oh, oh. What's the date of the mixtape so everybody know? I ain't put no date on it. There's no date? Ah, okay, okay, Is it coming okay. out this year? Is it coming out this year, this, this season, this quarter? What? It's coming out this year, but first, I'm going to just let some of my friends that I'm working with get their shot. You know, I'm one of the type of people, I let, I try to help people around me. Right. So, I'm going to let them come out now. It's their time because from November the 20th to... Uh, December 31st, I pretty much put the game in a, in a freeze box mm-hmm. where nobody could really do nothing. Locked it on up at a standstill, huh? Yo, I, yo. Up like arm and I, what? Yo, yo. When, when I used to come to Columbia, yo, you had you used to have that huge chain. What happened to that huge <laughs> chain, yo? I just, uh, well, well you, you still got that chain? I know it was like at least 50. No, believe it or not. I traded in the juice. I traded in the juice for the suit. Cause like, okay. like right now, I'm it's P Diddy on you know it's Jay Z. No, I traded in the juice for a suit because like I'm on a whole different avenue. You know what I'm saying? I'm on a different route. I'm hustling, so yeah. I'm just doing something different. That's what's up. That's what's up. I admire that because a lot of people don't. You know, when they think of rapper, they think of ignorance, you know what I'm saying? So it's okay to be an educated young black man in a suit, you know, looking nice, clean, lined up, tapered up. So I commend you on that, my brother. Yeah, that's definitely right. And, like, how you feel about, you know, the state of hip-hop, you know, and, you know, just with the social medias, Twitter, Facebook, and, you know, world star and things like that, do you feel like hip-hop is, you know, 
the Illuminati the, the Illuminati then got to involved in. That's uh, that's why Uh oh, one of these Illuminati ones. <laughs> the Illuminati then got involved in the game too much. So Oh wow. I think we can make me personally I I'm the type of person I don't care if I wouldn't get a record deal or not. I don't rap about where it comes from my heart. And I represent for where I stand from. Like, I stand up for what I believe in. I don't rap about stuff that I don't. That's hip hop. That's I talk about what I do. So, a record deal, I don't care if I get a record deal or not. I'm just doing what I know how to do it the best of my ability, working with the tools that I have. Yeah. That's what's up. So, I'm going to ask this last question just for me personally. I don't know if I'm going to read another one. Yeah, this is my last one because you know. Your last I, I'm just saying, this is my last question. You've like, been coming at oh, me all day since I got okay. this ring. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Anyway, <laughs> so my thing is this would you classify yourself? as an MC or as a rapper because to me it's two different things you know I mean I'm coming from like the old school even though I'm you know 80s baby or whatnot you know to me an MC is like straight lyrical rapper is more commercial what what would you say you know you are I'm me I'm a I'm me I'm I'm writing about I write about and rap about things that I know and things that I experience so I can't really put a category who I am, but true, as an artist, but I can tell you this much, everything on my resume is real about what I'm saying, though. Okay, so, like, authentic, 100%. I can respect that. Yo, Jay, tell me, how would you feel about this iced tea situation? Have you heard about it? You know? What iced tea situation? It's on Twitter. Is it sweet tea? Is it made with it's Slender? It's on Twitter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all know iced tea, man. <laughs> the, 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 the old dude, the cop killer, you know, the dude who's rapping about Iced tea. Yeah, yeah I like iced tea. tea. Long order. Iced tea and cocoa? I know iced okay. tea. Okay. Yeah. Is it me or is both their names like drinks? I mean, I'm just saying, like, iced tea that's cold, cocoa is hot. Like, I mean, <laughs> yeah, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't never thought about what's that. What's going on with that? But, but nah, like, um, this guy, yo, hold on, hold on. Check out the picture for for a second. Hold up, we got to see this here. Yo, yo, this guy, this guy why, why, is why? claiming that I guess he slept with iced tea wife. You know what I'm saying? He took pictures and all. And, oh and, wow. And they're taking tight pictures and he leaked them. So got her jammed what, up. What, what, what you feel? Like, what would you do if in that situation? Like, if she says she. She said she didn't do it, but, you know. These pictures don't lie. Uh, they, what? Man. I'm talking about if y'all go on there and look, it look, it looks just like him. You know what I'm saying? It, it looks like her. Like, no, I think I think that's her, but you know, she said it was just a friendly picture, and you know, it wasn't. I mean, hard. it could be because, like, from what I'm seeing, all I'm seeing is like a, it look like the dude is hugging her and a, a kiss on the cheek. It don't look like anything inappropriate. So until you show me like a home movie or something like that, I'm gonna yeah. just say it's just a friendly pic, and he trying to make it into more than what he is. You know, niggas is just as thirsty as bitches. Yeah, yeah, he definitely I'm on the radio, and I shouldn't have said that, but I'm just saying I feel some type of way about that thing. You know? <laughs> I definitely understand, man. But, I mean, this week, this week's tape is definitely going to be different, and I'm just collaborating with a lot of different people from where 